Yo, Coeptus, if you're watching this freaking video, please, 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 in a future update, add a decoration or something, or maybe even pets, so that we can add like fishes into aquariums like this. <laughs> I hope you guys are all having a fantastic day today. Ladies and gentlemen, we are once again back on the Bloxburg servers for a brand new episode of Bloxburg Adventures. And guys, we are joined by so many freaking people over here. I actually went AFK for a little bit right at the start of the video as I loaded in the house. And then when I came back, everybody was literally just lined up over here, guys. So we got Ethan Gamer, we got Queen Bay, we got Crystal Heart Rainbow, Squishy Fan, we got Daniela and Charlotte Sings. Thank Thank you guys so much for hanging out at the very start of the video but anyways guys it's been a couple of weeks since we've actually had a little bit of updates for you guys here on the 2018 mansion and ladies and gentlemen i'm finally gonna say it here for you guys today it's finally time to finalize and finish this mansion all right guys we've been working on it for a couple of months now i've kind of been taking my time with it not really building on a daily basis to finish it so i decided that today we're gonna go ahead and actually get started on it we're gonna probably do a little bit of a tour on another property as well so for all of you guys who are looking forward to the tours there will be a little bit of a tour at the very end of the video but anyways guys let's go ahead and get into today's video if you guys are excited for it please take a quick second right now go ahead and smash that freaking like button guys and while you guys are at it join our family here on YouTube hit that subscribe button as well I would truly appreciate it but guys as I said it's been quite some time since we've last worked on this actual house I want to go ahead and actually update with you guys a couple of things that we've been working on a couple of the things that you guys haven't seen yet and then obviously show you guys a couple of the things that we worked on on camera as well so walking in through the main entrance guys all these guys are going to be hanging out with me today as we check this out but anyways walking into the main entrance guys this is going to be like the main foyer of this entire location now when this is done there will probably be a lot of custom paintings and everything throughout these entire walls like as you guys can see some of the walls are not even done and colored yet so we've still got a lot of work to do here's a couple of the brand new fountains as well that were just recently added into the game a couple of weeks ago so you can kind of see how these fountains are going to be used for a lot of different decoration styles and there's going to be a lot of different ways that you can use them and utilize them inside your own builds to kind of just bring out a certain feature that you guys are looking for now a little bit further down the hallway we've got a couple of empty rooms over here see as you guys can see there's a lot of work still to be done none of these rooms are actually 100 fully completed yet but we've got a couple of rooms that are done like the garage we've got a couple of bedrooms over here as well which are fully furnished as you guys can see for some weird reason i think the server is lagging and I can't open this door right over here. What in the world is going on? A couple of these bedrooms are fully decorated as you guys can see. Uh oh, what the heck? We got our boy Ethan Gamer playing us a little bit of piano <laughs> anyway so a couple of the rooms are done as I've been saying guys and some of the things have been worked on as you guys can see I've kind of just been messing around with the kitchen a little bit moving around a couple of the decorations and everything is definitely coming along very very nicely this is probably one of my favorite areas of this entire house right now like standing from this corner just because you guys can imagine there's an aquarium on the left side formal dining room over here you've got a whole bunch of things just slowly but surely coming together for this actual mansion ladies and gentlemen down in the comment sections below I would love to get your guys's opinions on all the things that you guys have seen so far How are you guys liking the mansion that I'm creating for you guys? And have you guys enjoyed the episodes where we've actually done the live builds? I would love to know your guys's opinions down in the comment sections below. Can we get shout outs? Of course you guys can all get shout outs, dude Of course, by the way guys if I'm ignoring anything that they're saying right now It's obviously because I'm commentating. I don't mean to be rude or anything Queen Bay Of course, of course, of course Queen Bay you guys can all grab screenshots not a problem Anyways as I was saying in the last episode the last thing that we actually worked on was this little bit of an outdoor section right over here now as the summer update did come out guys we did work on this little bit of a section over here this is sort of like the outdoor section that uh you know everybody just kind of chills and relaxes at so this is kind of what we've been working on now obviously guys this entire area is not yet completed i feel like i could do a lot more with this entire backyard section so this probably right here is going to be in its own episode eventually when i do get around to it but as you guys did notice when i was stepping out of the 
patio. I did not account for this little weird pillar to be here. So I'm definitely going to need to move this around a little bit just to kind of, uh, you know, get that nice, easy flowing uh, exit out of the doorway over here. So that's something that we need to work on. And then obviously over here, guys, with the brand new summer update, a bunch of campground stuff as well. So this is kind of just more of like a fun section that the kids and stuff can kind of play at. Have a couple of sleepovers with a bunch of friends. This is kind of what this section in the backyard is for, just to kind of show you guys that you guys can have a campground or whatever in a mansion section. So there it is, guys. So what we're actually going to do over here, OK, well, let's jump into build mode. I want to talk about the plans that we have for this house just so I can show you guys exactly what we're going to be jumping into when we actually get into these build projects. And I know a lot of you guys have actually been watching the live build. So for all of you guys who have been watching the live builds, thank you guys so much for supporting the series. And I hope you guys have been enjoying all the episodes. Now, I do have to mention this, guys. The very last time I built this entire build menu was actually quite different. So it's going to take me a little bit of time to actually get used to it, guys, but it shouldn't be too big of a deal over here. But as you guys can see, they've added a couple of like undo and redo buttons. You can like kind of toggle the roofs on and off. And then obviously going up and down a level using the arrows on the right side of the screen right there. So guys, here is going to be my tentative plan, sort of like my layout or my game plan for this entire building project. All right, guys. So obviously the entire front entrance, I'm probably going to be spending an episode on this just to kind of add a whole bunch of decorations to fill this out. Now, I'm not sure if I'm going to be doing that on camera for you guys, but if you guys want to see that, just let me know down in the comments below. Now, this entire hallway section, guys, I'm not really quite sure what to do with yet. As you guys can see, there's a massive hallway. Like I could probably add a whole bunch of paintings and stuff to fill it out, but I'm not quite sure exactly what I want for all of these hallways that are kind of just leading into the other sections of the house. So over here, guys, you guys can kind of see there's a little bit of a side room over here with a bunch of windows. I'm thinking that this room right here is probably going to be like the kids room. I'm going to put a bunch of toys in there, maybe just like one bed or something like that. It's going to be like the main kids toy area. So a lot of the decorations that has to do with toys, I'm literally going to pack this entire room up with that. So that's going to be there. And then over here, guys, not really sure once again, what to have in this front foyer section, maybe just another living room section that people can kind of chill out where there's a lot of sunlight coming in from all of these front windows that you guys can see right over here. So there's definitely a lot to do with this entire build guys. And I'm super freaking excited to get back into building. Now I know that I've been working on this project for a very long time, but it's finally time to go ahead and finish all of this guys. Now, not only though, do we have the first floor? Hey, thank you so much for that. Nani. Thank you so much, my friend. Not only do we have one floor to finish guys, we also have to go up a floor over here. We've got a lot of bedrooms to decorate over here. As you guys can see, do you guys see this little office that uh, Tutu actually worked on? Look at this weird, awesome looking purple themed uh, room over here, guys. What the heck? I did not even notice this until just now. This is probably where in the house I'm going to be recording all of my YouTube videos. You know what I'm saying? Oh my gosh. Yo, Coeptus, if you're watching this freaking video, please, 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 in a future update, add a decoration or something, or maybe even pets so that we can add like fishes into aquariums like this, dude. Or maybe, you know what? Add a couple of fish tanks into the game. That would be such a freaking cool addition. And hopefully in the future, we can actually customize our fish tanks as well. Because as of right now, guys, we don't really have access to building anything that has to do with fish tanks. So I hope that in the future, something like that will be available here on Bloxburg. Now, anyways, guys, to top off today's episode of Bloxburg Adventures, I'm going to go ahead and hop around a couple of random servers over here. I'm going to find the very, very first thing that catches my eye to go ahead and tour for you guys, give a couple of opinions and get your guys' feedback on it. So we'll be right back, guys. Let's go ahead and find ourselves an inspirational build. Here we go. All right, guys, we've hopped onto a random server over here and there's actually a couple of houses that I want to go ahead and check out for you guys. Now, I know that in my normal sub tour episodes, I kind of focus on these really big mansions and a lot of you guys have kind of been asking me, yo, Mark, can you please tour a couple of smaller houses? Not everybody has money to build mansions. So what I'm actually going to do here, guys, is just kind of go through a couple of these houses that I saw on the server, give you guys a little bit of inspiration just by looking at it and hopefully, you know, making and seeing a couple of comments that will get you guys inspired to build and create on your own. But anyways, guys, over here, the very first house that we do have on the block is Ellie Rocks Like a Star. She's got this beautiful looking suburban home over here, guys. Very, very nice and small. Literally everything that you could possibly need in a house is probably inside here. Now, this is really freaking weird. Ellie happens to be a fan of us, actually. I just now realized she's actually got a friend request rolling over there and she's inside right now having a good time. How's it going, Ellie? Welcome to the video. Thank you so much for hanging out. But anyways, Ellie's got a really, really beautiful house over here guys hopefully you guys are inspired
inspired by it and uh i actually want to take a quick peek into a couple of the bedrooms over here just to see what she's got hey ellie how's it going let's see if we can go ahead and uh, check out the house a little bit over here just to be inspired by some of you fans out there some of the fam bam family members out there as well ellie thank you so much for allowing us into your home i'm such a big fan thank you thank you okay now walking in guys look how beautiful this entire house is she's got the same color scheme kind of going throughout it but as you guys can see there are decorations on every single wall guys this just goes to show you don't really need a mansion to build very very well here on Bloxburg. like literally as long as you have a little bit of creativity i feel like you can just create a nice and beautiful home but over here guys as you guys can see ellie has definitely you know watched a couple of episodes and has been inspired because her house is looking absolutely beautiful over here ellie thank you so much for sharing your lovely creation guys let's go ahead and actually drive around a bit because when i was loading in the server as i did say earlier there's a couple more houses that i do want to go ahead and check out but over here guys on the far end of the block what the heck is this like you got a full on like red barn house over here made by honey plum what in the world this kind of reminds me of like one of those doll houses like that people would play with back in the day bro oh my goodness all right now on the other side of this entire server there are two houses that caught my attention over there so wait guys i feel really bad i think this person over here is running around trying to catch up with me wait hold on i feel really really bad i don't want to leave her behind let me go ahead and change her permission for guest yo santa's so wavy get inside get inside my friend <laughs> we'll give her a ride to the other side of this entire uh server over here and not a big deal there we go all right now before we go ahead and end this episode there's one more house that i want to go ahead and show you guys on the opposite side of the server over here we also have to give a couple of screenshots out to people over here because they're asking the chat right now for a quick screen so not a big deal but guys check this out right over here there's this one house that kind of catches your attention but look how beautiful this small little house is like it's definitely a modern i wouldn't call it a modern mansion but it's more so just like a modern house like look at all the windows you can kind of see inside everywhere quick shout out to trinity 20169 thank you so much for having this beautiful eye-catching house walking around as you can see there are literally windows on every single wall so i'm not really sure if i would personally want to live in a house like this where there's literally no privacy but hey sometimes there's <gasps> Okay, let's not uh, let's not take a quick peek into that window because that is not what we want to do. Now, on the opposite side of Trinity's house as well, you've got Darian who is currently working on what looks to be a house that is kind of like a Miami style house. You know what I'm saying? It's got like that Miami vibe to it. Look at all the colors, the palm trees, the flamingos up front. Anyways, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and end the episode right there. I want to give a quick shout out to all these people just kind of hanging out today, having a good time. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. We've got a lot of plans for Bloxburg coming up in the next couple of days, so make sure you guys go. Go ahead and tune in every single day but as always my name is d field we'll see you guys again tomorrow for another daily roblox video have a fantastic day everybody peace